We are visiting a jewel of Wyoming. The city of Sheridan boasts mountain views, modern hospitality with an Old West charm. Come along and tour with us today. Blacktooth was formed in uh, 2010, open in November timeframe, right around Thanksgiving. Um, it started out as a 10, 10 barrel brew house um, and it was very successful. Sales kept increasing over time. Uh, and so they went to this expansion in 2015 and they moved from a 10 barrel brew house to a 30 barrel brew house, 10 barrel two vessel to a 30 barrel four vessel. So everything went from 10 or 20 barrels of production to 90 and 120 barrels per batch. So Blacktooth is named after the local mountain peak here in Sheridan in the Bighorns. It's Blacktooth, so if you look at it from afar, it looks like a black molar. We do some smaller batch stuff in Cheyenne. We opened that tap room a couple years ago, and so our original 10 barrel brew house got moved to Cheyenne, and they do some small batches there. Uh, but otherwise, everything is done here in, in large production scale. Most popular beer is Saddle Bronc Brown. Um, that one is definitely the one, it's an easy drinking, light, dark beer, if that makes sense. It's a very approachable beer. People would say, well, I don't like dark beers, but we always say, why don't you try this one? Then it tends to be okay. Uh, we do Wagon Box Wheat, which is very popular in our tap rooms, but we don't really put that in cans as much. We just don't think it tastes as good in cans. Then we have our uh, Copper Mule, which is a ginger lime cream ale. Uh, which is a little bit different, but it's a good refreshing um, little spritzy uh, drink. Bomber Mountain Amber is definitely probably our second most popular beer. Uh, that, that one wins awards too, just like Saddlebron. All our beers are award winning. We have Hot Streak IPA. Those are mostly our flagships. We do then some seasonal beers. And we have our barrel age program. We always have our anniversary beer, which is uh, uh, Imperial Scotch Ale uh, that is aged for a year in Wyoming whiskey barrels. And we try to do some more experimenting. It really helps with Cheyenne to do some fun things there. And we're opening up in Casper too. And we're getting that brew house all set up. So we have uh, the opportunity to do even more fun and innovative stuff. Blacktooth is a great place to hang out. There's always something going on, um, whether it be bingo night or food trucks. Um, there's always the locals that are hanging out at the bar. They have their regular spots. And it tends to be a good, um, place for people to just you know sit back it's it's kind of a chill environment there's there's some I mean we do have our events where there's live music but usually it's a good time to just sit and have a beer and the, the outdoor patio is heated usually and so even if it's kind of cool outside you can see kind of most of the city and right right downtown and, and see the mountains from here so it's a good stopover place for sure if you're coming through